uh, Tim and the Historical Society. Appreciate y'all putting this on. I'm glad to be here. I will also try to be brief, Ed, but I want to tell you a little something about me and who I am. I'm Jason Kane, and I'm running for Superior Court Judge for the Southern Judicial Circuit. The Southern Judicial Circuit consists of five counties. It's Lowndes, Eccles, Brooks, Coquit, and Thomas County. Now, I'm suspecting that most of you live here in Lowndes County, but if you live in one of those five counties, uh, you have a right to vote and choose who your next Superior Court Judge is. I was born here in Lowndes County, and I have actually lived here my entire life. And I live here in Hayara, Georgia. I live over on Barfield Street. I am married to the former Mitzi Taylor. Uh, we've been married, this June will be 25 years. And we have three children. We have a son who is 23. We have a daughter who is 22. And we also have a 19-year-old daughter. Uh, Miss is also from Lowndes County, and she teaches school up at Hayhara Elementary School. She's been teaching, I believe, about 23 years uh, here in the Lowndes school system. Uh, my mother is also here with me, and that's Jean Kane, my mom and dad. Mother and dad were in the jewelry business here in Hayhara for many years. Some of you uh, may remember Kane Jewelers up here on Main Street. Um, coming up, uh, when I was a young fella, I enjoyed, I enjoyed the sports, and depending on what season of the year it was, depended on what kind of a ball I had in my hand. If it was baseball season, I was playing baseball. If it was basketball, I had a basketball in my hand, or I was shooting at the goal in the yard. If it was football season, I was playing football. Uh, enjoy sports a lot, still do. Went to Lowndes High School, continued my, my, my sports uh, endeavors there, graduated from Lowndes High School. Uh, after graduating from Lowndes, I then went up to Tifton. I went to ABAC for two years and I played baseball up at ABAC for two years. After there, I went up to Americas. I uh, also played two years of baseball at Georgia Southwestern College in Americas. Uh, that's four years. That's four years of college, however, at the end of those four years, uh, I finally figured out I was in school to play baseball, not study like I should have been doing and following my parents' advice. But I did get back into school and I uh, eventually graduated from Valdosta State College, it was BSC when I graduated. Uh, after graduating from BSC, I sent an application to John Marshall Law School in Atlanta, Georgia. And they said, come on to Atlanta and we'll give you the chance to become an attorney. I did that and um, I commuted most of the time back and forth between Hayhara and Atlanta. I was working at Lowe's uh, most of that time. And when I was not in school in Atlanta, those, it was usually about two days. Uh, I'd go to Atlanta, I'd go to school, I'd spend the night, I'd go to school the next day. I'd come back home. Um, but I graduated from John Marshall, and after doing that, I became a member of the bar in 1994. November of this year will be 20 years that I have been an attorney here in Georgia. I have previously served, I served five years as a juvenile court judge, and that was in the Alapaha Judicial Circuit. After that, I worked uh, two years in the district attorney's office as an assistant district attorney. I was in the private practice of law uh, for about five years. And on January 1 of 2005, the state of Georgia created the statewide run Georgia public defender system. And since January 1 of 2005, I have worked in the Valdosta office uh, as an assistant public defender. And those duties include uh, representing uh, defendants charged with felony offenses. And our Valdosta office covers Lowndes, Eccles, and Brooks counties. And that is what I have been doing since January 1 of 2005. Now, as to the, as to the judge's job, 
Uh, if elected judge, my goal would be to listen to both sides of an issue, listen to the facts of the issue, apply the applicable law as related to that case, and be as fair as I would know how to be in any decisions that I would have to make. Now, hopefully, anybody running for judge, um, that would be their first interest in being as fair uh, as they could be with an issue. But you have to listen to the facts, you have to listen to both sides, apply the applicable law, and hopefully come up with a decision that's just the right thing to do according to the law. Um, Jason Kane, running for Superior Court Judge for the Southern Judicial Circuit, I ask for your consideration. I would appreciate your support and your vote. Thank you. Thank you.